all guys so um i wasn't going to come on here and do a video today but i've got two that i have to do and never mind all this crap and mess that's like from the dollar tree and i never guys i don't even dealt with that crap yet i still need to clean my house i need to do all kinds of stuff but you know what i'm gonna bear and grin it so anyways i have got a walmart slash kato's haul um so i'll show you I typically don't do like clothes clothing because I hardly ever buy clothes for myself unless it's goodwill related. Yeah. But anyways, I've got a thing that I've got to go to um Saturday, tomorrow actually. And I looked at Kato's first, didn't see anything there. So I went to uh Walmart because I knew that they had these little dresses. And so this is what the top looks like. And then y'all probably can't see this that good, but this is the other the bottom part which is gorgeous i love that so this was originally let's see 15.44 and i paid nine bucks for it so woohoo freaking score there right and so to make it look a little bit dressier and since you know i have tattoos you know taps i wanted to get this to cover up my tats not that i'm ashamed of them but you know when you're going to sing or something you want to look your best so i done this i got this this was like 12.94 so i found that and was really excited about that and i really need to hang that up um on to well i guess i could show you this also done a little couponing like the other day it was i can't remember when but and I haven't tried these. This is not really exciting, but, you know, I couponed with these, so I figured I'd share this as well. This is the French's um, Barbecue Mustard Sauce. It's the Twangy. Sweet and smooth. These were a dollar and... I'm wanting to say a dollar forty-nine or a dollar forty-seven, somewhere in that range. Had a 50-cent coupon and made these, like, a dollar. Maybe a little under a dollar. So I got this one. And I got the sweet mustard with brown sugar for a dollar. You can't beat that. And then I got this spicy one with cayenne pepper. Since I'm like, I'm a huge dipper. I like dipping my chicken. Like anything that I have, just about I'll dip with either ranch dressing, mayonnaise, honey mustard sauce, any of that. I love dipping my spaghetti and mayonnaise. It's just the best. And why am I telling y'all that? I don't know. I guess because of that sauce. So I got that for those for $3, you know, that's a really good deal. Then I got these. I'm all time owned to this kind of stuff. This is the Twizzlers Pull and Peel Candy. It's the fruit punch ones. And it's got grape, cherry, and orange. So I got those. These were on sale for $1.98 and they were like two something. So I had to get those. Um, on to Kato's. It was so funny because I had went to Kato's first and I looked around, didn't see anything that I was looking for. You know, like, I'm so weird. If I'm getting a dress or whatever, an outfit that I need, that day, the mood that I'm in, if I don't get that, then it's not for me. So I looked around, all the way around, even to the shoes and like, you know, the perfume and stuff. And as I was walking out, I felt weird. I'm like, she's going to be thinking that I'm either stealing something or I'm a weirdo. So, as I was walking out the door, I felt so weird because I left empty-handed. So, I went on to Walmart and found that. And then, I looked in the jewelry section. Their jewelry sucked. Like, didn't find... Like, half of their jewelry was gone. So, I'm like, okay, there was some nice jewelry there that I liked. So, I went back to Kato's. And as I was walking in, she was looking at me weird. And I looked at her and I'm like, um, can you help me out here? And I brought my dress in and she helped me pick out some stuff. And, um... I looked at her and I'm like, you probably think that I was a thief or um, a weirdo, right? And she looked at me and she smiled. She's like, no, but I was like, oh my God, what did I do? Because I was coming back into the store and I'm like, I was like, no, I was coming in to get some jewelry. It was just funny. But yeah. So enough with the rambling folks. So I picked this out. This is or this was $11.99 and it was on clearance for $7.99. Guys, that's a bit pricey for me. You know I'm cheap and frugal. Do you know how hard it was for me to even do this? Like seriously, yeah. 
$7.99, but it's a gorgeous necklace here, and I'm going to be doing it up Saturday. So I picked this out, and it's got all of these beautiful like stones on them. So I got that. I picked out a bracelet as well. I got these. These were originally $7.99, then it was marked down to $5.99, and then marked down to $1.97. Are y'all getting the path here clearance, guys? So, I got those. And then I picked these earrings out, but my hair's going to be down. You probably won't even be able to see my earrings, but that to match it. So, <clears throat> we were chatting while we were looking through all the jewelry, because it wasn't that busy in there. And we got on some conversations. It was funny. We was talking about tattoos and this and that and the other. And, um, yeah, my husband's totally calling. Hold on one second. Let me reject this. But I forgot to put it on airplane mode. Okay, I better hurry. So, um, anyways, I lost train of th a thought. Like, seriously. So, um, so as we were talking and then I was checking out and, like, all this crap run rung up to be, like, $12 and something... And I seen the necklace was $7.99. I was thinking it was like $1.99. And she was looking at me. She's like, what's the matter? I'm like, honey, um, that necklace is $7.99. And she looked at me and smiled. And I smiled back. I said, honey, I am a frugal girl. I'm a couponer. And this is doing a lot right here. This is out of my comfort zone. But it was funny. She got a good giggle out of it. She's like, well, honey, at Kato's, I can't help you with a coupon. I'm like, girl, it's okay. I'm going to do it up anyways. So anyways, that is my Walmart and Kato's haul. My husband's calling me, so I better bounce up off here. And I have one more video to do today. But I hope y'all are having a really good day, and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.